Hey guys, so today I'm making these uh, miniature slime soda bottles. Uh, you guys seem to really enjoy my last um, miniature slime tutorial. Uh, so I thought I'd take another crack at it and hopefully you guys will enjoy this uh, if you don't or if you do uh, Let me know in the comment section and I'd also love to hear uh, your suggestions for any other crafts that you might want to see So I just thought it would be a lot of fun to squeeze the tiniest amount of slime into some tiny little soda bottles uh, If you like this craft, please subscribe uh, and finally kids do be sure and ask a parent for help before starting this craft uh, Okay guys, so let's get started so I just start here with these um, floss packs. You may have seen me use them before in other videos. Uh, I get mine from Dollar Tree. You can get four for a dollar. And they're really great. They work great as cups also. They do have a tiny little hole along the top, but it's really easy to seal. Uh, and so you can actually put liquid inside of them without it leaking. And so here I just cut it to size. Mine is just under an inch tall. And this part is a little tricky. I just kind of saw it back and forth for a while. Um, because I don't want it to crack. And then I just apply pressure and I file the bottom using a sandpaper or a nail file. Clean out the dust. And then I'm just using my little um, X-Acto knife to kind of scoop out uh, any of the plastic that kind of flattened on the inside. To make the bottom section, I lay out some parchment paper uh, and then some hot glue. And I let the hot glue dry. I give it about 30 to 40 seconds. And then I place the plastic slowly into the hot glue, but I don't push all the way down because I don't want it to actually get stuck inside of it. And then when it's still just a little bit warm, I can start to slowly peel it away. To give me a nice lid that will fit snugly. And then I trim around the edges, but leave just enough that I can um, grab it to pull off and on. And I get started on my slime. So I'm just using clear Elmer's glue. That's what I use for all of my slime. And you really won't need much because these containers are so tiny. Add some starch, just a few drops, using my little container from a previous tutorial. And I just get started mixing. And I just add starch and glue as needed. Until I have the desired consistency. And I like using Elmer's clear glue because my slime is a little more see-through. And as you massage it, it'll get smoother. And when no longer sticky, I divide it into four sections. use food coloring to make my soda. For my Fanta or my orange, I mix yellow and red. And for my Mountain Dew, green and yellow. And for the Sprite, I simply leave as is. And finally, for the cola, a little bit trickier, I just mix my red, blue, and green, which kind of gives me a dark purple, but I think it works. And for the lids, I'm just using thick craft foam paper and the medium setting on my multi-hole punch. Can hot glue it to the top, which will also seal that tiny little hole. and begin stuffing my containers. Just adding little bits of slime at a time. And 
And finally, for my labels, you can either Google actual labels or you can use the printables that I've created. And I'll link to it in the description section. And you are so totally good to go. Well guys, I sure hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks guys!